Hey folks, how are we doing? Quick little video this Saturday afternoon. Gonna become hopefully a big mother trucker and get a CB fitted to the old fast track. That's the plan anyway. Oh, Liz has turned up. Now we've got to test this horn, haven't we? So we'll beckon her over and we'll do a horn test, see what uh, see what happens. Oh, come here a minute, would you? Ready, steady. <laughs> Works then. Uh, yeah. Is that loud enough for you? Just slightly. Think, think the neighbours will hear it. <laughs> Lovely shore blast. That was uh, the side effect. The side effect. Well, well, first things first. Why have I gone for CB rather than two-way? Now we had two-way radios at Henry's, and they are better than CBs. They're clearer and there's more range, but they cost more. So. I went with a good old CB radio because they're, yeah, they're, they've come on a long way as well. And um, you know, this new Thunderpole T3000 is supposed to be the bee's knees. So um, we will have a look. Oh, so there you go. I mean, look at the size of that, it's nothing. Nice big old heatsink on the back. You've got your power there and you've got your aerial connection there. And these are 12, 24 volts, so you can go in lorries and tractors. So. Uh, yeah, smart. You can either mount them like on the top there with our brackets like you used to, or like with this one. We're going to mount in there so it's a nice tidy finish. Right, well the power lead comes with obviously a fuse and quite handily there's a spare fuse in there as well in the holder. And it comes with a cigarette lighter so you can just plug it in. But um, I'm going to hardwire it so um, I've still got my cigarette lighter spare. Right, the aerial mount is on the mirror arm there. Cable comes along here. It's tucked in along the side of the uh, roof here. Comes down the C pillar and then down and then should be in the back behind this panel. So I've just took the screws out. And yes, there we go. There is the aerial cable. Pull that through. Like so into there there we go right that is everything I need behind the um, uh, radio now so we can uh, get the radio in orbiter uh, yeah the orbiter on the aerial mount and fire it up see if we can find any truckers right so this is a mini orbiter uh what is it a meter something like that yes yeah, about a meter isn't it, i should think maybe a bit less um yeah it's probably a bit less can get the full size orbiter which is um a bit of a monster um but uh, yeah i've always gone for the sort of the, the mini orbiters they're a you know nice compact uh, aerial so we'll get this mounted up Right, so I am all ready now to plumb in. There it all goes in there. Power goes in there. Tuck the cables back in and there you go. We are laughing. Now it's a nice, decent looking, uh, smart install, isn't it? Do, 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 do. Get that on mic. Yeah, like so. Awesome. Break the break of one now. We got ourselves a calm boy. Right, let's see. Uh, see, we've got some power. 
Yippee! Yippee! So we've got an auto squelch button on the mic in the middle. We've got channel up down on it as well. So it's handy. Yeah, breaker breaker one nine. You just you just have to do, when you get on CB you have to talk like that, didn't you? So we have got um Right, so that is just I'm presuming that's your squelch there. Yeah, but you got like I say, it's got an auto squelch feature, so that is good. You got mode and band there, EU, AM, UK, yeah, FM, EU. So that's easy to do. Nine one nine scan. So if I'm, I mean, it's been a long time since I've been on on CB. Um, was it nine was emergency? Is it emergency channel? Nineteen is the general channel. Can't quite remember. We're not getting any um, any incoming, are we? So they're they're on a quick button. Ain't well, quick scan buttons and then back to the channel we're on. We've got colours there, which is that's neat, isn't it? Nice display that is. And we'll go with sort of a greeny yellow. And we've got um, box and a lock button. So. Right, so we'll just take it out the shed and um, see if we can hear anyone. I'm not particularly confident because it's, I mean, yes, we're right next to the A1, but um, it's Sunday, you know, it's Sunday morning now, and um, I doubt we'll hear anything, but uh, we're going to have a, have a quick listen, see what we can find. Um, I mean, that is the other thing. Um, how many people actually use CBs this day, this day and age, you know, with a uh, advent of smartphones, you know, um, hands-free calling, Bluetooth, decent hands-free systems, uh, you know, voice calling. You know, it really has hit CBs hard, but they have still got a place. I can still use this. Oh, that is the other thing. Just finishes it off. Gearkeeper. So it's just there. Look at that. Oh, we're getting some static, boys. So yeah, you've got, you've got to have a gear keeper. Yeah, 10, 10, uh, 10, 9, 9, 8, 7. Uh, Victor, Brava, Charlie, uh, 10 for me, buddy. So um, yeah, like I say, I can use this legally still. Um, but obviously if I had a phone in my hand or whatever, I am illegal. So uh, there is that bonus to you know, CBs and obviously two-way radios. So um, yeah, but I was, but the other thing, a lot of the folks that are on CBs or were on CBs have moved to two-way radios because they are, you know, slightly more expensive. But you get clearer speech, or you, you know, you're used to. Um, you probably still do. Like the ones on, we had the Henrys were, you know, ever so clear, and they did have a good range lot. Um, but uh, yeah, we'll go and see what. Um, we're definitely getting some activity on the channel, so we'll go and uh, see if we can hear anyone well I'm not picking a lot up you're getting the odd bit of static just keeps coming on but uh, nothing in range uh, no surprise really because like I say it's a Sunday so um, but uh, no I'll have to get um, get some more in the other vehicles and then that'll just make our lives easier like you know in the field and that you want to just quickly say oh move this trailer up or whatever just grab on the LCB, away you go lot. Just makes life a bit easier, doesn't it? But uh, I've got a job for you lot. I haven't got a handle, I need a CB handle. So in the comments below, put down, uh, we'll keep it fairly clean as well. <laughs> so I know what you lot are like. Um, put down your suggestions for my CB handle. You've got to have a CB handle, isn't it? it's got to be done. So um, yeah, anyway, 
let me know what you think and i hope you enjoyed that video and i'll see you on the next one ta-ta